How's it going? I love watching television shows, as you can probably already tell. I like sci-fi, comedy, dramas, little bit of reality. I love watching television shows with friends or family or by myself when I'm feeling happy and inspired or especially when I'm feeling sad and lonely. Not only are television shows incredibly entertaining, they have great lessons about life and relationships that you can apply every single day. For instance, I was watching Grey's Anatomy the other day and I learned that if you do the superhero pose for five minutes before an important event, you'll feel more confident. So if you're super stressed out about an interview or maybe your first day of school, just take your fists, put them on your hips, look up, put your shoulders back, and hold that pose like a superhero for five minutes. Try it now. I'm serious, stand up. Are you standing up? All right, five minutes, guys. I feel like Superman, I need a cape right now. Okay, we'll pretend like it's been five minutes because I'm not just gonna stay here for five minutes, but yes! Don't you feel more confident? I do. It's things just like that that I have learned from television shows that I can apply in my own daily life. So in today's video, I am going to share with you all the wonderful things that I've learned from television shows. Let's start with my childhood. I watched a lot of Boy Meets World growing up. One of the most important lessons that I learned in Boy Meets World is to believe in yourself, dream, try, and do good. I learned from Topanga to just be yourself, no matter how weird you are. I learned from Eric that Life is hard. Get a helmet. How I Met Your Mother taught me. Wait for it. And also that I'm gonna be by the Proclaimers will never, ever get old. Even when you are driving cross country and that is the only thing you can listen to. It is the perfect road trip song. Friends taught me that building and hanging out in forts is totally cool. You can still do that as an adult. It's not just for kids. I build forts regularly. There's a couple videos on my channel about blanket forts. Phoebe taught me everybody has a lobster. And of course, Ross taught me two very important lessons. When moving a couch, only correct way to instruct the people helping you is to yell, PIVOT! Also, that you should learn to try to master the art of complete awareness, or unagi. Danger! Parks and Recreation taught me that the three most important things in life are waffles, friends, and work. Or, friends, waffles, and work. It doesn't really matter, but work comes third. It is incredibly important to take time to treat yourself. If that means you need to go out and buy a replica Batman costume, go do it. You deserve it. One of my favorite shows in high school was Gilmore Girls, and I learned so many valuable lessons from that show. For instance, it is possible to get hit by a deer. It happened to me a couple weeks ago. A deer hit my car. That happens. The plural of cul-de-sac is cul-de-sac. Just because you stay in on the weekends does not make you lame. Your personal path isn't the same as others, and that's totally okay. Not everything works out the way you want it to, but that's okay. And finally, be unapologetically yourself. Finally, the TV show that I have learned probably the most from, aside from Doctor Who, you have noticed I have not mentioned Doctor Who in this video, it's because I will make a separate one. But the TV show that I have learned the most from and that I have named my channel after is One Tree Hill. If you wanna know that association, I made a video about it, I'll link it in the description. One Tree Hill has taught me that you matter. Your actions matter, your art matters. We're all crazy. Some of us just do a better job at hiding it than others. Don't be afraid to say how you feel because life is too short to hold it all in. Whenever you're in need of help, music is always there for you. People always leave, but sometimes they come back. It taught me to own my own feelings, to write them in a book, on a desk, on the basketball court, but never run from them. Every song ends, but that's no reason not to enjoy the music. Everything happens for a reason, some good, some bad. And one day, everything will work out for you. And you'll look back and wonder why you let all the other stuff ruin your life in the first place. And the final thing that One Tree Hill has taught me is that I don't wanna be anything other than what I've been trying to be lately. That all I have to do is think of me and have peace of mind. Well, there you go, guys. Those are all of the great things that television shows have taught me over the years. Let me know in the comments what are some of the most valuable lessons that you have learned from a television show. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I will catch you guys next week. I'm gonna leave you with one final piece of advice that comes from Grey's Anatomy. When life gets rough or stressful, all you gotta do is dance it out.